All right, and we're back, uh, and it's, it's just me, Soda, solo commentating. So uh, excuse me for staying quiet a lot. I'm not a talkative person, but I try my best. Uh, looks like we're going with uh, Smashville. No, town and city, right? Uh, new stage. Uh, lots of platform. Lots of place to run around. So I'm guessing this is Akumara pick. And Andrew somehow already at 100%. This is kill percent with deep breathing, and uh, I think that's what tri Aku is trying to do here. Oh! Oh, you can just do that. Snipe him. Good snipe, good snipe. Up here, yep. Oh, he, he lets go the trigger like a tiny, it teens a bit too early. Don't stay at ledge and don't try not to challenge with it with deep breathing because that socket will just do straight up 15%. I think with it is the only character that has moves that have hit both sides of their body. Like it's weird. Oh, are we gonna see a three star? No, I don't think we're, we're gonna see a three stop with that. Yeah, it is going pretty well for Aku though. A whole one stop the head, and he can just potentially just camp out Zelda and just stay on the ledge, spam volleyballs, deep breathing. Oh, what happened there? I'm not sure what happened, but it brought it back to an even game. 47%, not so bad. Uh, we'll be right back in a few minutes. Everybody is just paying the bill right now. In the meantime, I'll update the score, which is one for Aku. Akumara still has a uh, 
quite a long way to go though. He needs to win the next... He needs to win two more games to reset the back bracket and then win three, three more games. Alright, we are back ladies and gentlemen, and uh, Andrew looks like his game plan changed. He's gonna take the volleyball and <laughs> just it's just funny seeing with it like trying to go for a soccer ball. Oh, what is going on? Everybody's just trying to hit each other off stage. Good string. Oh, he just jumped into that. <laughs> uh, finally, after the kill, like, we fit got the soccer ball back. And we're gonna see him spam it again. Oh, really nice, nice bait, but no, uh, got nothing out of that. But cool idea. He might, he might be able to capitalize on. Oh, <laughs> he just stole it right out of the air. Yep. The the interesting thing about Isabel pockets and villagers pocket is that. It does more damage when the projectile is returned. Uh, and we have a tactical pause coming out here so everyone can pay their bills. We'll be right back in just a second. Thank you. 
Oh, oh that's bad. <laughs> they both make it back. What's the punish? Good, good, good punish. Aku probably needs to like get up auto. Oh! Fancy trick coming out from Andrew, just re grabbing the volleyball again. And just like like I said, uh, Andrew needs. Uh, Aku needs to uh, break off his muscle memory of just throwing the soccer ball because it's not there anymore. Punish? Okay, yeah, grab. Okay, here comes this deep breathing. Uh, fishing pole up throw is gonna kill here. And an unfortunate buffered air dodge coming out from Andrew is gonna give away the game to Akumara. And we are just one more game away from back bracket reset. I, I didn't catch this what the stage that was, but I'm guessing something small, like a battlefield. Oh, we're still going back to this. Towns and city. The thing about Isabel recovery is that it doesn't have a hit hitbox, so that's why we see Akumara just going for this without not not a lot of consequences. I think Andrew is just trying to catch the uh, salute the sun. I'll never get used to this with his voice line. Voice line it just sounds too different. I'm not sure what version of the game we are playing on. Alright, good catch. Nice. I think we're gonna see a bracket reset fairly soon here. Aku sitting pretty with 3 stocks at 100%. Just building up on more damage onto Andrew. Yep, and once again, Andrew is at 2%. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Any stray hit's gonna kill. He's trying to dunk him because there's no his bug on the recovery. Oh! <laughs> Aku is just styling on, trying to style but fail. Alright, good patient, waiting for the get up option from 
Akumara and punish accordingly. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. That's a back crit reset. Uh, so the reason for that is Akumara was in the loser bracket and he was coming up to the winner side. So he has to reset the bracket. So now they're even. And now if Aku wins three more games. And he is the champion of Saigon Spot dot number twenty nine. Alright, we're still going back to the same map, but Andrew is going with Zelda now instead of Isabel. We already seen this the first game. Maybe Andrew can adapt. So far, doesn't look like it. Sitting at 85%. Deep breathing. Oh, he just sweet spotted him out of there. We are back at even. Alright, patient. Good reaction coming out from Andrew. Punishes the air dodge. Oh, and the Zelda. The neutral beat from Zelda is just so deceptive. Its visual doesn't match its. Reflecting durations like after the crystal thing ended, the animation end ended, there's still actually a few more frames where it still reflects. Alright, good stall on the air, avoiding the fun phantom soldiers. And we are one again, once again, bracket even. One stock a piece. Deep reading with it, you just hit him hit him twice or three times and there it's sixty percent.
Ooh, ouch. That's the power of yoga. Yeah, game number five, I think. And uh, what I like to see is, oh wow, what a read! Nine percent. Man, the damage damage output from Griffith is just insane. Good stall. Even hit him with the soccer ball to cancel out the Phantom Soldiers. All right, up throw. Wow! Ah, uh, he needs to respect the deep breathing. Just wait it out, man. Wow, did you see that soccer ball? He just bounces his back right, in, right into Aku face. I think Aku is slowly catching on to the teleport to the other side of the stage to hit you trick from Andrew. And he needs to be careful, that, that moves have a lot of luck. Yep, just wait out. It's only a few seconds. Oh no. Andrew misses the ledge. Unfortunate SD. And we are just... Actually, it's just one game away from crowning Aku as the... Winner of Saigon Spot 29. All right, looks like Aku is playing smart, banning all the small side stages, like battlefields. So now that forces Andrew to have to go to this other small stage. All right, what's the game plan here? He's sticking with his... Zelda? I'm not sure what he can do to 
flip the situation here. Ooh, ouch! Read the tech in place. Yep, that's dead. I think that was the first, like, the few times Andrew actually has the lead in the game, but then it was shut up, like, immediately after by an F smash to the face. Andrew is actually sitting on his last stock of the tournament right here. And Aku is just one let up. The damage just keep going on and on. He's at 91% now. And uh, Andrew just let out air. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> All right. <laughs>